Welcome to the Planisware MedTech Horizon series. Episode 1 will focus on project management. Hi, and welcome to the BioFuture organization. As the portfolio governance meeting approaches, Tom, the head of PMO, hello, is reviewing the status of the portfolio and identified issues with some projects. He asked Susan. Hi, how's it going? To provide a training refresher for the project managers to make sure all the data is always accurate. Let's have a look. Hi, everyone. The goal of today's session is to provide a refresher training on the project management capabilities of our PPM solution, Planisware. On our agenda for this meeting, we have the project list, the schedule, the phase gate, and project versions. To get started, your project list should look like this. All of your projects and their status with the various attributes you need. You can each tailor the view to your needs and choose which columns to display. It looks like our project PVS204 is red. Let's drill down and find out more. Here's the basic schedule where you can update your projects with the same capabilities as MSP and more. Planisware follows all PMI best practices. You can easily add or remove and update tasks, save baselines, and highlight the critical path. What if I need to use an existing template? either to start the project or to further detail a specific phase? Great question. In that case, you can use what we call activity libraries. These are a list of pre-saved templates that you can import at any time and anywhere in your projects. The activity libraries include tasks and activities, resource assignments, costs, and other pre-saved attributes you define. Great. What about updating the schedule so that external vendor feedback is considered? You can do that too. It's as easy as importing MSP files directly into Planisware. That's amazing. This is really going to help save time. I love the drill down from the project list directly into the schedules. BioFutures project managers have everything they need to work on their projects directly in Planisware. By maintaining the same capabilities they're used to, we ensure good user experience, adoption, and change management. Another crucial part of project management is the phase gate. Planisware can create varying phase gate workflows for different teams. This will allow you to track deliverable progress alongside the phase and gate workflow of the project. At the bottom of our screen, we can see who is working on what deliverables and when they've been submitted and approved. Keep in mind that this list will dynamically filter based on the phase you have selected. Note that the deliverables can be documents, links to other systems, forms, or even links to different pages within Planisware. That's really nice. But we already have a documentation management system. Of course. Planisware is also able to fully integrate with external systems. In order to use deliverable management, will we need to check this page for updates and follow up with owners manually? No need. We have already set up notifications that will be sent out automatically via email, Planisware, and Microsoft Teams when people are assigned as deliverable owners or approvers. A fully integrated phase gate and schedule allows for automated approval workflows. This significantly reduces manual effort required to drive completion of work. All right, and the final item we will review is project versions. Versions empower project managers to create what-if scenarios at the project level. As you know, every time there is a change of direction in the strategic roadmap, we are asked to provide potential impacts of the change. Fortunately, Planisware helps automate the creation of multiple versions for the same project. The version comparison screen here will help us compare the impact each version has on our KPIs, reducing the manual effort needed for PMs to come up with accurate potential forecasts. These versions also roll up to the portfolio view, so our leadership can select which versions fit best in our portfolio. This will be useful to them in the portfolio governance meeting happening in two weeks. Project versions is a functionality used by most medtech organizations. This functionality saves project managers a lot of time and helps ensure accuracy of data used for portfolio governance. Throughout this video, Susan and Tom have demonstrated that a single source of truth for project portfolio management increases collaboration, productivity, efficiency, and trust between project managers and portfolio leadership. And that wraps up Episode 1 for our Horizon series. Thank you for tuning in. 
If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us at planisware.com. We hope to catch you on our next episode soon.